hi guys um hope you're well hope you're having a good weekend i'm just going to do a couple of videos today that um i thought that have got to be a must so um here we go yeah um yesterday my mum was sorting out her old makeup stuff and decided to throw a lot of things away so obviously she knew to throw them my way um because we i don't throw any makeup out and um yeah i'm going to show you some old vintage makeup <laughs> as i call it it's old vintage it's not old old proper vintage but it's old um so yeah uh first things first is this very old <laughs> elizabeth um Alden amber bronze it's bronze in powder it's number 11 and it's sun kissed as they call it and it's in this plastic container can you see that there is a real old style this is if you can see that there I'm on the iPhone so it's not going to probably there you go it's not going to probably pick that up I'm not quite sure and it looks just like this it's got a mirror as well there there you go it looks just like that and obviously I've got this bouncing light here hitting me at the window so you're not going to see anything properly so I'll do some swatches and there it is and it's quite a lovely pale pale bronzer actually I quite like that I don't think you can even see it when it's so pale that's my dog barking in the garden playing with my husband and my son yeah you can't really see it but it's lovely I've been wearing it on my cheeks today I doubt you're going to see it because I've been out and it's been on since 9 o'clock this morning so um yeah but really really like that so I'll let you guys know it's quite heavy with the mirror as well where it's old style packaging but I quite like that so this next one is um Christian Dior what is it ah it'd be good if I could tell you but the whole thing on the back is completely gone no, I can't even read the back of it. Look, it's completely and utterly wiped off. But I will show you. And it's just like that. So it's got the mirror there as well. And it looks just like that there. With the 3D stencil kind of effect on it. And it doesn't smell that nice actually. It smells quite... Sorry to old people, but it smells like that old people kind of floral perfume smell. You know what smell I mean. I don't want to offend anyone, but it's that it's that very floral, old people kind of smell. Um, don't like it when I rub my finger over it as well. It feels quite harsh. Um, and it's there. It's a real dirty, dirty orange brown colour. You can't even see it. It's not even coming off on my hand. So it's there and it's so old but i just think that's pretty cool so that sits in my drawer as well um wait a minute another thing is um i've got so many of these palettes you they always chuck them in free whenever you buy anything from dior so my mum had one that she's never used and this one is, let me see, number one palette, it's combination for the eyeshadow. So I've got quite a few of these, the old ones, but not this colour one. So all the four colours on the top are eyeshadows and the two there on the bottom are lip glosses. Sorry about my nails, I've been picking my nail varnish off today. I know it's one of my pet hates, but there you go. So yeah. They're quite nice, so I could do some nice, real nice pinky, kind of smoky eye look with that one. So yeah, that's quite cool, you should never use that, so that's good. And another one is this, um, uh, where are we, the lip pencil. Try again, Elizabeth Arden, let's have a look. And I don't know what colour it is, because it's completely wiped off. It's quite a deep, deep brown kind of colour. I could wear this actually as like a real deep whiskey kind of colour. Reminds me of whiskey from um, Urban Decay 24-7 liner. But I um, I think it's too dark to wear on the lips and especially with the Viva Glam, the latest one, it's quite it's too dark for that. But I reckon I could wear that for an eyeliner. Definitely, it smudges easily though. So um, I don't know, I'll give that a go and see how it is. And 
one last thing that she was getting rid of and I said no please don't um, is let me see bear with me is Clinique which looks just like this very old indeed it's an eyeshadow and it's in number six frosted blossom and there's no point showing you that because you can't even see it and it's very old school can you see the old there let me do a swatch for you my french manicure has gone so bad so that, can you see that's a real nice frosted kind of pink glow that would be nice as a highlight color i reckon in the corners so i'm doing a nice pinky kind of look so yeah like that as well so that's my old vintage kind of as i call it makeup um not going to waste and um yeah and just to let you guys know that i do have a blog um if you guys want to go and check that out i've had it for quite a while but i never really it was on hold for probably about six seven months i didn't do anything to it so but now i think i'm gonna really keep on top of it and do so many blog posts a week with it so um i'm gonna do swatches and pictures and put all this stuff on my blog page and my blog page will be around here somewhere in a little switch mark or this side all the way through this video i'm going to keep it up so my blog page will be somewhere along there so um yeah you can leave me comments on there as well and please have a look so i'm up to any suggestions on it's you know it's not that brilliant layout at the moment some of the bloggers that i follow they've got fantastic pages and brilliant borders and everything but um yeah mine's pretty plain at the moment so i i am sorry but please have a look and please subscribe to it because i think i've only got like seven people on there or something for the last year or so so pretty lonely on there really but i'm gonna start getting up to date with it and doing it really well so um yeah go and check that out and um i'll see you for my next video thanks for watching see you later guys bye